Oh, welcome to my channel, Diagonal Matrix. In this session, I'm going to discuss about the accept all. So what does it mean accept all? Uh, it's technically, it compares two data frames um, and it verifies if the second data frame has got any rows in the first data frame. If so, then they eliminate them. Precisely, it just accept the rows from the second row or the second row data in the first frame and then return it back. So that's the you know accept um, all uh, command accept all uh, method. Now um, practically, I'm going to show you this way. I have taken two data sets. The first data has got the A1, A1, A1 three times, and the B2, B2 two times, and the C3 is a one time repeated. So in the second data frame, A1 once, B2 once, C3 once has been created as a tuple. Now the column names I have created as a column one and column two. Now, technically what has happened, when I do accept all, it checks B2, data two, uh, you know, data in the data one. And since it's A1 is already there in the data one table, data one data frame, it, ex it excludes um, the repeat, it excludes this value and just display the remaining two values. Let's practically have a look at it. Now I'm going to create data frame data is data two and schema is column. Super. Now I'm going to show the data. Shift enter. Now you are going to see uh, these uh, sample data in a data frame, right? You will be seeing it two data frames. Great. Now, if you observe carefully here, the first data frame has got A1, A1, A1 three times and the B2 two times and C3 one time. Second data frame, A1 once, B2 once, C3 once. Now I'm going to apply the accept all. The way how I'm going to do it, df1 dot accept all put df2 and then I'm going to show. Now you see, the expected results are A1, A1, B2. The way how it's going to work is it excludes single A1 from the three times repeated A1. So you get only two repetitions of A1, A1, A1 over here. And you have got one B2 out of two B2s, one excluded. So the second one has been repeated over here. And it has got single C3 in both the data frames. So it's take off those C3, so therefore you don't see any C3. That's all about the except all. So yeah, that's all in the session. I hope you enjoy. Thank you very much.